project. We have artists from Chile and Venezuela and Sierra Leone and Gambia who all live here now and they're all bringing a little piece of home whether that's their food traditions or their artistic traditions and sharing them with children and families in Waltham Forest. Things like this project, looking at food growing, children at Yardley Primary can get involved with things like organically where they can go up and get involved in local growing. I help them grow the plants, people, everything. you will invite a thousand friends, right? Yeah! I'll give you a thousand friends for now. I am a storyteller, I am a motivator. Uh, I see myself as an architect for social change and cultural awakening. We shake it, we shake it, we shake it, we shake it. So I engage in traditional African storytelling and I give these stories contemporary relevance. My work here today is to inspire these children to appreciate what nature provides. The story that I'm telling the children, it's got food in it, it's got farming in it. It was quite exciting and I thoroughly enjoyed it. I think we need more sort of fables and stories with morals because there are some things in the world that are happening like wars and it just teaches us what we could do to the world to make it a better place. My family came to the UK as refugees. Uh, I was two years old when I came here. We would let this different plants and vegetables boil up for about 30 minutes. Yeah. Maybe within an hour you'd have a colour that you're ready to use. We're going to be doing eco dyeing and also some weaving with the fabrics that we've dyed. One of the ways that I connected to my culture growing up was through the food that we ate. The workshops, they're very much linked to our stories and we're hoping that the people that come to the workshops will be bringing some of their stories of how they may have arrived to Waltham Forest. The storytelling will be a way to kind of break down those barriers and connect us all a bit more. It's a joyful gathering. You know, you're happy, you're proud that this is happening. To go and out there and start empowering people is quite an honor. Jimena and Elizabeth were very keen to look at getting children really thinking about being more sustainable with everything that we do. Yeah, the drumming is bringing the people together as well. It helps the children to their social emotion. They are listening to us well. You can see the interaction, you know, me being on the stage, doing the call and respond, they responding to the drum. We're really responding to a need for bringing people together across different communities to use music and dance to help people's mental health and well-being. Awesome.